Okay, the synchronicity of the world. Look at this. I've just walked in the door after that walk and it's raining. Look at that. It's raining. Um, so yeah, that walk was about an hour. Uh, we are in winter and that's probably a fluky thing that always happens to me. Wherever I go, I take the sun with me. It's just been sunny most of the time. So I just want to, um, the background to what I've uncovered in the last two years of not working with me coming finally to this realization of um, PTSD, um, also ADHD, um, and grief, and how that is so not diagnosed and so overlooked in the medical industry. I've even used an integrated doctor, haven't been diagnosed with any of this, it's just through me literally self-assessing and self-researching and trying to figure out what the heck's going on. So I've noted that a delayed birth, which is what I had, my mum was taken to hospital and then they said, no, we think it's twins, so you need to go to another hospital that's more equipped for that kind of delivery. And so I think that that was the stress, trauma, that's possibly brought on ADHD. Um, there are lots of other things that I've uncovered in my upbringing. For example, my mum going back to work very, very early after having me and being looked after by my dad and being bottle fed. And now know how important it is for that contact with the mother and the breastfeeding. Then uh, age two, there was a parrot that squawked and I came out in full body eczema. As you can see now, I haven't had this ever until I've been under quite a lot of stress in the last, I don't know. I could say the last couple of months, but it feels like it's been longer than that, years. So, body's trying to tell me something. I'm listening. Uh, at the age of two, a parrot squawked. And um, I can't even remember if I've told you this now in this video. Short-term memory. Um, came out in full body eczema a day or so later. And then I had the traumatic age 12 moving from England to the other side of the world. Losing all my friends my home, still grieving over that, and it's been nearly 30 years, still so homesick, um, then a whole, hey guys, how's it going, what a journey, it is November the 22nd, 2022, I am eating a banana, look at me, and I am eating pea protein, it's a complete amino acid, so six tablespoons of that a day, and two smoothies, uh, half a banana, a little tiny bit of a banana in each of my smoothies, What can I say? The healing I have received is just phenomenal. Never did I think that when I first started doing these videos in May that I would be feeling this good in November, six months. I slept, I have slept for the last five or six nights solidly. I feel energized, my mood is great. I feel like my body is healing, like I have a body again, I just, I want to share that the quantum machine that I was um, tuned into last Friday was the biggest godsend ever and I want to let everybody know that there is the technology out there that can scan every organ, every every part of your body and it will show you what's going on, what's wrong, what needs fixing, what parasites you have, candida, everything. And the lady that's um, 
got the machine, has got the experience and the know-how to remedy. And I have confidence in her as well as the diet, the suggestions and what to be eating. I have really struck gold and I am the luckiest girl in the world. Thank you for listening and I'll talk to you all again soon. Hey guys, how's it going? It's been a good six weeks now since the hyperbaric oxygen chamber went back. I have found a quantum machine that I've been hooked up to with Lemongrass Health here in New Zealand and she was amazing with what she was able to detect in um, my organs and the infections and the parasites. She said that I should keep doing what I've been doing because I have the um, smallest amount of ailments, infections, parasites that she's ever seen. So that's good news. Um, she's also giving me the um, Enhance Energy one here. That's a bit of mitochondria energy. And then the Free Radical, um, it gets rid of the oxidative stress, the Free Radicals, that one there. Trying to help open up the detoxification pathways with that one there as well. So feeling good, uh, diet's really good. She's got me on some lovely smoothies um, with a bit of pea protein in it and banana, which is amazing. Okay, and I'm remembering what it is that I come in the kitchen to do. I have got the house all tidied and kids clothes are away and I've made two months worth of bread just on the weekend, so that was 24 loaves of bread. I've got the energy to do this kind of stuff. I'm sleeping pretty well. I'm really pleased with how I was sleeping, especially taking the mitochondria. That was good as well. All right, much love. Talk to you soon. Bye.